she doesn't get enough okay she doesn't get enough pardon she doesn't get enough girls she doesn't get enough she doesn't get enough money she doesn't get enough slots she doesn't get enough holes she died from an overdose what's up y'all so today is more of a bad vlog like all the bad stuff that's been happening to me in the past day so Today at work, um, I forgot my camera, so no pictures were taken of all the Smurfs, but it really didn't matter because not a lot of people dressed up because everyone at work's lame, with a big capital L. But a couple people did. Um, there was Vanity, Dreamy, Lazy, Taylor, Poet, Papa Smurf, Smurfette, and then everyone else just wore regular clothes. But... Um, there was a lot of conflict going on between our teams. We have four teams in our class. Um, two, my team and another team had conflict. So one person from each of our group went up and talked to our teacher about that. We had a big class meeting and he asked each team, you know, how do you think your team's doing? The other two teams were like, oh, we're great. We're helping each other learn. And he gets to the other one. And one of the girls in their group was, yeah, um, our team's not very good because they leave me out and I get real distracted and Keith comes over and distracts me and he horse plays too much and he's so immature. And I was just like, oh, okay. Um, how about instead of, you know, making a big deal about it, you should come and talk to me and say, Keith, I feel like this. And all three of them were like, um, no, you're just mad because we don't include you because you don't speak up and say anything. And when Keith comes over, we're not doing any work. So he hasn't been over here disturbing us in a while. So before you start talking, you need to go on ahead and stop making up lies. So I was just like, oh, wow. woo!" And then it got over to us. And one of the people on our team is learning a little bit slower than the rest of us. And we had to um, practice patient calls. So one of us had to be patient. The other one had to be the patient care advocate. That's our job. Um. And I was a patient, and he was a PCA. And I was trying to be one of those rude customers that's rushing you and has such an attitude. And he was getting mad. He's like, you're not helping me, and you're being so obnoxious. And I'm just sitting there like, yeah, that's what customers are. If they don't get what they want, they get impatient and obnoxious, and you got to deal with it. I'm sorry you can't handle the job. Maybe you should look for something else. And one of the girls got up from her seat, went over there, and told him what to do step by step by step. And he was just... Acting like, you know, I know this is a fake call, so I'm not even going to try. He was all, we don't want you calling, and what do you want, and why are you so annoying? And everyone on my team looking at him like, I hope you really don't talk like this. And he brought that up, and it just got blown up out of proportion. People were starting to yell at each other. And after all of that, we went back to our teams, and then the teacher left. And after that, all hell broke loose. The girl who was talking about me, Dolly, started talking to the other three girls, talking about how left out she feels and all this stuff and they didn't want to hear it so they put on their little um headphones and were talking to each other and she said oh you bitches are gonna leave me out again keandra one of the girls over there she just went off she was telling her you know i don't call you out by your name don't call me out by my name you're 30 something years old you have kids the age of me learn to act your age and she was just going on and on and then jennifer started get yelling and then ashley was just sitting there like i'm not getting in the middle of this and she just kept talking about me over there she was saying keith's so disrespectful keith's so disruptive and I'm like, can you come and tell me? Because I can hear you. But after all that, you know, we got that settled and finished class. And we left. So walking out, Jennifer comes up. Oh, yeah, Dolly was still talking about you. And she has a big problem with you. And I told her that if she has a problem, she should come talk to you. That's what I was saying. So I would get home from work. You know, I had to ride down the street with my blue face and big flower in my ear. And everyone was looking at me. I was embarrassed. I caked on that makeup so thick. I looked like my stepmom. So I get home, you know, check my YouTube, and I get my first hate comment. Woo! And it said one word. Do you love it? <laughs> I love that saying. Do you love it? I was just like, whatever, you know. Hey, I guess that's supposed to be hurtful. It wasn't. Sorry. But, yeah. That's it for hurtfulness. Oh, Brittany. Oh, my gosh. Did y'all hear about Kev K-Fag? He's, like, on the set of some show. I think it's One Tree Hill or... Some shit that no one watches, some TV show, I don't know. But he's, they, sources are there saying that he's walking around the set smoking weed and stuff like he, like it's no big deal. I'm like, what? And he has cussed, you know, that poor Brittany with her bad extensions or is walking around getting yelled at by people and walking through Target not buying anything and then showing her nana again. 
You know, I think those kids should just be put up for adoption or something. So, my phone got turned back on. I'm so happy. Bank of America was like, yeah, they're taking too long. We're just giving you back your money. I was like, okay. So, I paid it and made sure it worked this time. So, it did. Um, that's enough for my personal life and Brittany. And... So, I have discovered the new Tyra Banks. You know how Tyra is so stuck on herself? Well, we have someone else. <laughs> I know, right? What is up with that neck? Kamora Lee Simmons. I mean, she is an Amazon. Like, what is she, 12 feet tall, 7 feet tall? I don't know. She's up there. And she's just so stuck on herself, too. Like, have you seen her show? Ew. But, you know, the hills were on yesterday. Oh, my gosh. Lauren is such a bitch. I don't like her. I do like her, but at the same time, I don't. I love Heidi. Heidi and Spencer, they rock. But yeah, that's about it. So tomorrow is 50s theme, so I will be dressing up like that. So until next time, peace out, people. Dicky ride, don't you want a dicky